Wow. Can I catch my breath for a second? My heart is like going like crazy right now. The purpose of life is to have a life of purpose. Let me repeat that. The purpose of life is having a life of purpose. The sociologist Scott Peck in his book, The Road Less Traveled, opens with a very simple sentence, a premise. Life is difficult. This isn't a judgment. It's simply a statement. And he asks us to think about three questions. Number one, how are we going to deal with it? Are we going to be a victim? Are we simply going to survive? Or are we going to choose to thrive? Second, who are we going to share that life with? Avoiding negative, superficial people who suck the life out of us? Or be with people, loving people, with texture who care? Third, what are we going to do with our life? What is going to be your legacy? Many of us in this room, being professionals, have taken the time to develop a business mission statement. But have any of you taken the time for a personal mission statement? Actually written it down? I have. And mine consists of four things. One, to live as a mensch. In Yiddish, that means a human being, a good human being. Number two, to have raised my four children as good people, people who will contribute to the world in their own way, whatever that happens to be. Third, that I live my life fully and passionately and with adventure. Sometimes too much adventure for those in the room who know me. Um, and finally, and most importantly, that I gave more than I took. In the Jewish world, it's known as tikkun olam, to heal the world. We all have the capacity to give. We all do. Giving is just another way of showing love. And love is an infinitely renewable and limitless resource. Giving can take many forms. It can be your time. It can be your talent. It can be your wealth. But it can simply be a kind word, a gentle touch, a caring and respectful gesture, even just something as simple as a smile. Many of you know that over the last few years I've been faced with an extraordinary number of challenges. Yet despite this, I truly believe that I have been blessed. All of us, all of us had had times in our lives that have been difficult. But we have the choice to rise above. Positive mind, positive life, you've all heard that before. And as I said in the video, my license plate really does say carpe diem, seize the day. I can't thank you all enough for this honor, but I only want to accept this honor on behalf of the many people who are in this audience, many of whom I know who also give back and possibly inspire others to do just a little bit more. I believe with all my heart that to move forward, you have to give back. Finally, a very simple guideline. If you knew, need to choose between being right or being kind, choose kindness. Thank you. <laughs>